I am really on a roll today. My husband took my oldest to the movies. Loud summer day. Stephanie camp. Camp is over. Ooh, can't wait for school to start. So I'm home making my own movies. This is just from a spider plant that we put into a smaller pot. We have this pot left over from potting up a jade hobbit. And that's got some of these green bean peronias. Um, they've been, had about two weeks in water propagation. They have quite a bit of quite a bit of roots. Every place that a leaf comes out um, typically grows roots. So we've got two of these looking good. You know what? I think I'm just gonna put the biggest one in the small pot. I had a huge hobbit jade in this one. Waited a little too long. Um, a mix of soils here just because this is what I have. We'll see what happens. I've got some pretty dense soil that came out of a spider plant and then I've got some Espoma's uh, succulent mix or cactus mix. So mix all those together. Big guy down in here. Make sure all areas are covered right up against the roots we'll do this compost heavy mix the mother plant for this one is gorgeous uh, it's huge and it just keeps growing and growing it's getting out of control so we make a lot of babies this would be a Two and a half inch pot for green bean peronia. Um, it's gotta be under, you know, be in our window or downstairs in the grow lights before it'd be ready for sale. But this is what a two and a half inch pot would look like, and we wait till it grows up. Uh, typically, we sell four inch pots for these, so we'd wait uh, probably six months until I've got that one ready for sale. Thanks for potting up with me today.